If you're looking for the ultimate entertainment destination, look no further than R1 Indoor Karting in Lincoln. They have it all, and Brendan recently dropped by to see what's new. From racing to, yes, even axe throwing, R1 Indoor Karting has it all. What started as a go-kart track is now becoming an entertainment destination in Rhode Island. We still have the go-karting, of course. We have a restaurant which has uh, band performances every Friday and Saturday night. We have bowling, we have darts, we have an arcade, and we have the X bar You can even have your function with them. You can do all kinds of parties. There is kids' birthday parties, adult birthday parties. We do a lot of bachelor parties, family gatherings, school reunions, team buildings, corporate events. But let's talk more about the axe throwing. It's one hour of throwing axes to a target. They play games. There's an axe coach to help you. So before you start playing games, of course, there's an axe coach who teaches you all the steps to do it safe. So how about a lesson for our intern Ashley and me? We were ready. Put your other hand on top of it. You put the axe over your head and you put all the weight on your back foot. And then you move to the front. And where you were aiming, you release it. Grab an axe. Maybe I should start with the small one. <laughs> no, no, we'll do the big one. <laughs> After a few more tries, I finally got the hang of it. Yeah! Ashley, I don't know. I think from now on you should call me Bullseye Brendan. It took you like five shots to get that. Stop one. it! Axe throwing done, time for us to prep for the racetrack. After a quick tutorial, if you are stuck against the guardrail and you want to help yourself back on the track, what do you do? It doesn't say scream incoherently, so I'll have to choose something else. It was time to get our photos taken. Okay, sir, I'm trying to get you an aisle seat and that'll be a non-stop flight. Now we're going to suit you up. I have a giant head. Helmets on and strapped in. The infant needs some help. We were off to the races. You think maybe I should slow down? <laughs> Our fast and furious competition behind us, it was time to celebrate. All right. Ashley, race is over. How do I look? I would put it back on. Yeah, good idea. The crowd went wild. Please, hold your applause. Calm down. Looks like you had a terrible time. <laughs> Awful. I'm never going back. We went there shortly after they opened up a few years yeah, ago, I believe. Yeah, I remember. You took to the track? I did. I, I felt um, uh, anxious. <laughs> to, I am not the biggest fan of driving in general. I'm very cautious. But it was fun to kind of let loose a little bit on that track because you, you're safe. It really is. And they have so much more going on than they had back when they first opened yeah, they, up. Yeah, they didn't have the axe throwing the last time I had been there. They've really grown a lot. How did you do with the axe well, throwing? Well, you see, I missed on several attempts, but then I started to get the hang of it. And it is all about the follow through. I have to say, I do not think I'd do well with that. <laughs> I but I bet once you get the hang of it, it's like really, I, it could release some tension. It could, and yeah. you could just put my face right, right in there, and then I would do very well. <laughs> she picked it up like that, and then right after they put this photo. Well, it is such a fun place, you guys. They have so much going on, and as you just saw, from great activities to delicious food and drinks, they're also working on an adventure game, which is coming up. They hope to open up very in cool. May. Peter showed us a little sneak peek of that, and it looks so very cool. What else is happening? If you would like, yes, to plan your visit, we'll have all the info you need. At Roadshow.com and for an extended behind the scenes look at our visit to R1 and to see how that piece came together to go behind the scenes. I love that. If you will, yes, our digital reporter Emily Gibbs will have a road extra on Roadshow.com chronicling the entire experience of working with me. <laughs>